Right, three weeks and counting, and the work here at the TV Roadwell site not set to resume until next week. They hope to get a temporary pump replaced with a permanent one sometime this week and then move their attention back over to this site. In the meantime, it happens as federal authorities have been touring the city, taking a hard look at the city's troubled water system. A host of federal partners touring Jackson in secret, including representatives from the EPA. Until we have new systems, the systems we have are the systems we have. And it's not a matter of if, but a matter of when they will fail again. The mayor hoping for federal help with the water system at a time when the president and Congress debate a massive infrastructure package that could provide millions in financial help for the water and road systems. What we got into was an opportunity uh, for those that are looking at uh, the challenge of, of infrastructure around our nation to actually put their eyes on the challenges in the city of Jackson. Uh, I have said before that, you know, when it comes to the need for resources, I, I would like to be the face of, of infrastructure in this nation because I know that my residents need true support uh, in order to deal with these challenges. The latest challenge are two broken water wells that have left thousands of city residents with little or no water pressure for three weeks now. Just low pressure. You know, uh, and no no kind of advice from the water department of when it's going to get better. If you are still experiencing uh, a lack of water or low pressure, that you reach out. Uh, don't assume that the city of Jackson knows. The mayor asking residents to report their water problems as the city moves towards a permanent pump replacement at Sidewell Road. If everything goes well at Sidewell Road, we would take that temporary pump and move it to TB Road until we can officially start uh, the repair at the TV road well system. That permanent pump expected to arrive sometime tomorrow for that Sidewell Road site. They will have to map out how they're going to go about it and realize that work will take some 12 to 16 hours. A resident's not having any water coming out of that site. A likely precautionary boil water notice to fall in the meantime. The work on this site hopefully will start next Monday. Live in Jackson. Scott Simmons, 16, WAPT News.